All right, we're back in Village Bagel, the new bagel shop located on Highway 6, just across the street from Riverwalk. I got Anthony Mazzo. You're the owner. You're owner, right? Part owner, yes. Me. Part owner. Yeah, me and my partner in life, Connie. Connie Leaf. Where is Connie here today? She is at the Vail running class with Ellen Miller and all those guys that go run up the mountain. So we needed to get her out here so she could enjoy some life. So I've known Anthony for quite some time. We're fishing buddies, um, but you're taking a little swing, a little change. Tell us about where, where did this inspiration come from? What was it that started it all? Connie's originally from New York. I'm from Pittsburgh. And she said one day, like, we don't have bagels in Vail, like real bagels, like boiled and baked bagels. And so uh, she was actually sitting on the train visiting her dad, going from the city to the outskirts. And, uh, and I, as a surprise, I made her... Uh, I made her a bagel, and that was two years ago. You made her a bagel? Yeah, at the house. A boiled bagel of sorts, right? Yeah, exactly. So you knew how to do this a little bit from home? I mean, not really. YouTube, man. YouTube, YouTube helped us make all, get all <laughs> bagels together. So we're going to keep chatting with you while you're cooking up some yeah, stuff. Right. So how's it been? I mean, from what I hear from everybody, people are loving it. Yeah. And it's a completely unique style, flavor, the technique. Tell us about kind of what goes into the backstory of the bagels. Yeah. Yeah, so it's a three-day fermentation on the dough. So we go a starter, and then the next day we shape them. And this is the last day. This is day three, and ties. Our head baker here is dropping the bagels into the water, getting them a nice little wash, and then getting them in the oven, seeding so, them. And you said something about boiling a bagel. That's like really the only way to officially do it the right way, right? Truly, you have to boil a, boil the boil the dough first before you bake it. Yeah, but you only boil it for a short amount of time. Yeah, it's literally 10, 15, 30 seconds, depending on the size of the proof. It's all feel, you know, because the bread changes every day with the humidity and the moisture in the air. So sometimes they go in for 30 seconds, sometimes they go in for 15 seconds, just depending on how much they grew overnight on the proof, in the slow proof. And, but it's not just bagels. you got other stuff going on in here, too. What do you cook? That looks pretty darn good right there. Holla, holla French toast going. We make the holla here in house. Okay. We got our bagels ready to rock and roll. And we do all of our eggs fresh in the pan. Keep going, I'm going to Sorry. <laughs> So you're just cranking. We got a little line of people out front. I'm excited uh, to, to come and spend some time here over the course of the summertime. We're going to explore different parts of Village Bagel. Um, you got a great seating area. What a nice little space. Yeah, thanks. We appreciate it. It's uh, we just wanted a little cafe style. You know, Connie wanted bagels specifically, and we she wanted to have a little. Her favorite meal is breakfast, so she wanted a little cafe diner esque. And here we have it. I love it. I'm going to talk to Ty. Let's yeah. swing over. Ty, can I have a, two minutes of your time? Okay, so you are the head baker? I am, I guess. <laughs> Thank you for being here. All right, tell us, like, the process for you. I mean, you drop them in the hot water for 15 seconds or so, and you throw them in, yep, in the oven. Yeah, 15 to 30 seconds or so for most of them, and then uh, when they're wet, we put them in the seeds, and the seeds stick, and we double-side them and try and get them good and coated in seeds, and then throw them in, and they do, depends on the oven, where the oven's at, but they right. do three rounds maybe and then we flip them like uh these guys are going to be real close in a few minutes wow and then we'll uh flip them and they'll do another four or five rounds roughly eight to ten minutes and then they're done and sit out go. here for a minute and get a little real quick tell me real quick like what's the most is there one particular bagel that pe people have just died to come in to have like one of the particular flavors uh it seems like all of them are really? hot do you, have a, do you have a favorite i, I like chocolate chip Chocolate chip. We're going back to Anthony. We have a little bit of time left. Let's swing back over here. All right, Anthony, we're going to get out of your way and let you get after it. But uh, what are the hours and where's your location right here again? How do you explain it to people? We're 7 to 2. We're right across the street from Starbucks, right next to Wags and Whiskers and Edwards. So if you're going to pull in the parking lot to go to the thrift store, exactly. don't take a left. Go straight ahead and you're right there. Yep, you pull right into us. Go catch some fish, huh? Yeah, buddy. Thank you. All right. I got some pictures to show you. <laughs> Thanks, guys. Good catch up. All right, Village Bagel located right in Edwards, right across from Starbucks. Ty and Anthony, Laura and Jenny and the rest of the crew are willing to make it really good for your day. Can swing by Village Bagel from 7 to 2 daily.